What it do, homies? It's your boy Dave, and I'm back today. We out here with another Rusty's reaction. This time we're taking a look at Stressed Out featuring Chi Chi. Okay. Now, just based off the just based off the uh title. And I know the type of stuff Rush has been feeling and stuff about his music and stuff. I feel like I'm going to have a whole lot to say about this, man. I'm telling you. I hope this this might become another one of those rambling, dissect Dave kind of things. But we're going to go ahead, shut up, turn it up, and let Rush speak his truth, baby. Let's go. Took a boat and I'm lost at sea. I've been keeping my head down. Can I cope with my endless dreams? On the edge and I'm stressed out. Reaching strong every piece of me. I'm filled with self-doubt Too afraid I can't leave it be On the edge and I'm stressed out Yo, man, come on, man. Already. Already. Dang. Hold on. Hold on. Already, Rusty. I've been keeping my head down. Can I cope with my endless dreams? Can I cope with my endless dreams, bro? How many of you guys are like victims to your over ambitions? You know what I mean? But I'm I'm the same way. This is the reason why when I when I had my first channel and I made this and you know first channel and I, and I got lost that and I made this one, I realized I was driving myself crazy because I just wanted to keep working and working and working and working because I have these dreams and stuff that I want to hit. But it's important to take a break and everything. But I feel that I cannot cope with my endless dreams. Right? You feel like if you work more, it's gonna make you feel better, but in the end, it's actually destroying you. So. This is gonna be one of them videos, I'm telling y'all. Dreams on the edge, and I'm stressed out. Reconstruct every piece of me. I'm filled with self Double focus. To a fit, I can't leave it be. On the edge, and I'm stressed out. Uh. Past the point of no return, I'm a last cause Take a look at what I've earned with my art form The fate inside you can still burn at your last draws Look into my past more, this is what I've asked for mm, He said to, yo, check this out, he said the flame, hold on Inside you can still The flame inside you can still burn, burn at, your at your last straws, right? When you think about like instance, if you burn like incense Them things gonna burn all the way into the end, right? But he's saying that pretty much any time no matter where you at in your life, no matter how depressed, you still got that fire that's burning inside you. And that right there is what can, that's what, that right there is the difference between like, like beginners and like champions, you know, that drive, that push forward. I like that. Last straws, look into my past more. This is what I've asked for. <laughs> my emotions make no sense to me. I thought I would be happy when reveling in prosperity. So then I feel ungrateful when it's painful that you'll question me. Why is my work the only thing that's forming my identity? I don't deserve all the praise when I'm making this music that's average at best. No. I don't deserve all the people that watch me in hell with my rampant success. Uh, I can keep on grinding, but I'm finding that I'm fearing what will happen if I pause and take a break. Mm. I will keep on smiling through the crying and I'm trying to be better, but I feel like I'm a fake. See, man, dang. Yo, Rustage, man, I swear to you, bro, right here, if I pause and take a break, bro, see, there's a... What is that? What was it saying? I heard it way back when I was younger. And they said every day that you ain't like working, somebody else is catching up with you. Right. That was just such a powerful saying. I've always kept it in memory. Every time I take a break, I'm just like, oh, snaps. I could have been this much farther. I could have been this much farther. Right. And it, just, it makes it hard. to It makes it hard to take a break, bro. But it's so important, man. You spitting truth out here. Yes. Uh, I can keep on grinding, but I'm finding that I'm fearing what will happen if I pause and take a break. Mm -hmm. I will keep a smiling through the crying and I'm trying to be better, but I feel like I'm a fake. Took a boat and I'm lost at sea. I've been keeping my head down. Can I cope with my endless dreams? On the edge and I'm stressed out. Reconstruct every piece of me. I'm filled with self-doubt. Too afraid I can't leave it be. On the edge and I'm stressed out. I'm proud of it, loving the sound of it But I get embarrassed when it's played in front of crowds Cut it, I don't care if they love it That might sound insane, but it's hard for me to tell If all my music sounds the same, does it? I feel guilty when I'm reading all this feedback All these people like it, but it's awful, can't they see that? When my peers say I'm good, I don't know if they mean that Maybe I've forgotten how it feels to just relax Non-stop, every day to day, I hate to say I'm starting to waste away, I'm making plays I'm frightened to take a break, it's way too late I'm fighting to tame the strain, the pain betrays I'm sure that I'm just lazy I'm a whiny kid acting like a baby when all I need is an iron fist I be feeling crazy, don't know my knees like it's hieroglyphs I've achieved my dreams, but look at me and what it finally did You know, you know, uh, 
there is a misconception about people, especially when people who make it like really, really big, whether it be on YouTube, where it be anywhere, that they believe that they live like the easy life, right? Because they work is they work is really good, right? Uh, they're getting paid, they're doing what they love to do. They believe that work is easy, right? But people don't understand that. You know, and not necessarily now about the money, but more money. And it's just general, but more money means more problems, right? The more, the better that you get your craft, the better you are at your craft, the more and more and more you got to start leveling up yourself, right? And then if you are, if you're the type of person who likes to humble yourself, then the, the more fear that's going to kind of set in every time you, every time you release a track, because you're going to want it to be better than the next. Now, of course, this is important for you to grow as an artist, but that stuff mentally drains you because you sitting here, you working yourself down like oh snaps i got I, I did like for instance if you if this was your first time singing right you just set the bar for how you sing it now you can't do anything less than what you did on the other one and ultimately the only person who's going to know if that track is finished right and, and it sounds good is going to be you but it's just the the thought that everybody's going to hate it which is what with what, 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 um Seaches you from releasing stuff out. It's no different when you're sitting there and you're drawing on a, on an art piece, right? And I can tell you this from experience. Sometimes it's hard to stop drawing on there and call it a day because you're always seeing all these problems and all these flaws and everything. So you gotta, you know, the, the self discipline is something that you gotta like, like practice and whatnot. And you practice that self discipline and like and, and like learn to stay humble. Then it makes it a little bit more bearing when you start getting, you know, when you start progressing throughout the uh, throughout throughout your craft. But uh, it's like, like I said, it's tough, man. It's real tough. I struggle with that every freaking day, bro. Every freaking day. Like, for instance, sometimes if I can't record with this camera that you guys see, this is this is like my standard of quality. If I lost this camera, I probably wouldn't record at all. You know, I probably wouldn't do anything. Um, of course, if I talk to my wife, she'd be like, why don't you just use your phone? I'd be like, no, I can't do that. I got a quality that I, I want to upload, upload. But that stresses me out, right? Because, um, and YouTube content's king, right? You can have the quality, but if you establish your value where you need it to be, then people gonna come and watch it, or at least I hope. But I understand that, right? Now I'm not a I'm not a rapper by any means, and I'm not a singer by any means. But the, I'm I'm just kind of like relating to the fact that I need I I really want this camera as my quality, you know, versus like an artist who really need this sound as their quality, so they can't go back. But it's just it it places an enormous mental stress on you, so. I, this is feeling, I think this is the most vulnerable we have seen rustage. Crazy don't know my knees like it's hieroglyphs. I've achieved my dreams, but look at me and what it finally did. Took a boat and a must at sea. I've been keeping my head down. Can I cope with my endless dreams? On the edge and I'm stressed out. Reconstruct every piece of me. I'm filled with self-doubt. Too afraid I can't leave it be. On the edge and I'm stressed out. Shut up. I've been thinking too much. I wish it could all just shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Acting like there's something wrong, really. I need to shut up. Shut up. Shut up. I've been thinking too much. I wish it could all just shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Acting like there's something wrong, really. I need to shut up. So, here's, here's another thing that's really that, that I applaud Rustage for doing. There's a whole lot of people that take that type of stress, right? And they kind of internalize it. And what that does is it makes them turn around and make like a really, really huge mistake that can end up costing your career. When you got to remember that, you know, most of the, you know, music is an outlet, right? It's a therapy for most people. See, now what Rustage did, and, and this is why it's really difficult, is because he put those frustrations and those stress into this song. And he's pretty much reaching out to his fans and letting us know how he's feeling. Now, it's it's hard. It's hard to bear your feelings to what he got, like 700 something thousand people. Right. And, and, and he's kind of got that overlay message saying, you know, hey, I'm, I'm feeling this way, but maybe I should shut up and be grateful and everything. Um, I, I just I just appreciate it because this is not something that a lot of people can do. Right. A lot of people kind of kind of play off like their feelings or everything. But like, man, he'd be like, hey, man, are you stressed? Be like, no, nah, bro, I got this. I'm cool. But then go in the corner and cry. You know what I'm saying? So this is this is what I like to see from artists. See this right here. This right here is an improvement. Right. You in tune with yourself, man. You 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 know where you, you know where your issues are, right? And instead of internalizing, you put it out in your music, man. This is why I love music, man. It's an ultimate therapy. You can put anything you need right out there, and it will make you feel better as well, cause you cause you released it instead of internalizing it. I've been keeping my head down. Can I cope with my endless dreams? 
on the edge and I'm stressed out Read the script every face on me I'm filled with self-doubt To a fan I can't leave it be On the edge and I'm stressed out Whoa, oh, oh, oh. Look at what I am, an imposter with a fake grin Like, can you can you imagine being so happy with your, you know, being so happy with your success that it turns around and because of that success, it's turned around and made you hate what you thought you loved? Like, that's 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 insane. That'll drive anybody crazy, man. This is whoo, rustish boy. You didn't pull it out a whole lot here, man. And I hope that you was able to at least release some of this throughout this song. And now that we've connected with you, you know, you see down here and down here in all the comments, you know, you got all this, all this happiness, you know what I'm saying? Putting yourself out there, uh, you know, people understand everything. There is a lot of people who definitely uh, understand what it's like to be in your shoes when it comes to being stressed out about your, about your craft and then, you know, uh, starting to, like you said, uh, self-doubt when you start to think, yo, am I really, you know, am I really worth all of this attention you know you know what i'm saying but honestly man hopefully the comments right there you know all the information that you need is like literally right there that you doing your thing and we appreciate it every 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 single day man now of course i've only been listening to you for about a year and a half and everything because that's when i just discovered the nerd core but from everything i see man you pull your you put your heart into your music and we enjoy that absolutely enjoy it but you need to take a break because you need to take like two weeks off. We still going to be here. But you've been going nonstop for how long? We going to be here, cuz. <laughs> All right, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments. That's the end of this video. If you enjoyed the content, leave a like and subscribe. Dave's out.